Okay guys, so this is gonna be the first video, clip, whatever, of my new hair journey. I'm very excited. Um, This is the second time in one year I'm gonna be cutting my hair off. Um, yeah, so I did a big job by myself in June, I think, of last year. And... Um, I didn't show y'all, I didn't see, because I didn't like how I looked, but I got my hair straightened at the Dominicans, that's why it's, like, like that, or whatever, and it wasn't anything on them, but my hair was very dry, I feel like I neglected it, um, because once I cut it, I just been putting it in braids, wigs, or whatever, so I definitely didn't moisturize it how I should have, and my hair just got, like, very untamable and dry and everything so when i got it done at the dominicans like literally my ends i have to wear a hat because my hair cannot stay slicked down because it's just so many flyaways because it's so uneven and dry um they cut it and it still doesn't look good so today i have a consultation at 145 um and I don't know what's up with that. Like, since when do you have to go in person for a consultation? Like, you about to make me go all the way downtown for a 15-minute talk? We could do it on FaceTime or Zoom, girl. Never had a consultation before, so I don't really know what to expect. Um, I want to go short, and I want to dye my hair. Like, let me see if I can show you. Like, a chocolate brown. This color. Like, I fake... Fake want it to match, like blend in with me like i just want to give like natural this is my best state like this is me like just free if you get it you get it like i just want to tap back into my naturalness because this past year i've been doing like a lot of braids and wigs lashes and stuff so i just want to go back to how i usually was like i would do my wash and goes barely got my lashes done because i used to pick them out od let me see if i could show y'all my hair like right before i damaged it and that's why i cut it the first time because i bleached my hair and then i used high color it was just a bad situation i really should have just left my hair alone and i was just fiending to just touch it so i messed it up my hair was doing very good but okay so yeah this was my hair before like do you see are y'all seeing the definition the color the volume like Everything about it was just giving. Just look how full and healthy it was. Like, ugh. I think that was the best period of my hair. Then I went to go and touch it and mess it up. What I try to do, I try to touch it up. Like, my roots from that color. Because, you know, after a while it grew out and it faded. And then it ended up coming out orange. Like, my hair was just, like, done up. Done up. Orange, okay? My hair just basically broke off and I tried to dye it back black and everything and it didn't make a difference so I just cut it off last summer like it wouldn't retain moisture or anything so here we are back at square one but I'm not even like sad about it or nothing like I'm fiending to get it cut like I want it done but I don't know how the consultation is gonna go so I don't know if y'all gonna see me there but I'm gonna just keep y'all updated on the process whatever clips you get you get so today is the day, today is Thursday, you guys saw me when I went on Tuesday, um, and of course I'm late, it's 1.43 and my thing was for 1.45, but I should be there in like 5, 10 minutes tops, it's not my fault, it was the bus, like I had to eat after class, whatever.
So this is the finished look. I, well, I didn't really, I wasn't really recording while she was cutting stuff because she wasn't jacking it. Like she didn't want to be recorded, and she was like right behind me. But um, yeah, she shaped it like I think you could kind of tell. First of all, like my curls in the back are tighter than my curls in the front, so it was kind of like my sides in the back are lower than the front. So I feel like you could see that. Um, it has to grow on me. I don't like how she, like, the products she used. Like, literally, she used the Shine and Jam mousse that you use for braids. And she combed that through and put some oil. Like, girl, I could have done that myself. But I'm not complaining, okay? I'm not complaining. Um, the color didn't come out exactly how I wanted. I want it to be, like, a little bit lighter. Like, you can't tell it's brown unless, like, I'm in light. Um, I'm gonna just, like, go in with a blow dryer and try to dry it because it's really wet. And then eventually, like, I'll, like, fix it how I want it to be. But, um, I just gotta get used to it for real because I feel like I look like a little boy. Especially since it's, like, dark and my edges isn't done for real. But, you know, embracing natural me. You know, I might have to throw on some, like, highlight or whatever once in a while to remind me that I'm a girl. But it's okay. I want to make a whole series or like playlist or whatever concerning my hair journey. Um, yeah, y'all see it's still wet, so I'm going to take the blow dry and dry it out. But yeah, I'm going to keep y'all updated um, with the growth and everything. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to, you know, keep in tune, stay in tune, stay updated with my hair journey. And I'll see y'all next time.